Hey everyone. Um, so I've just written an e-book called The Spirit of the Liberty Cap <clears throat> and the intention for the book is um, yeah, to create a, a really useful practical guide for foraging mushrooms but also really weaving in the, the spiritual aspects and, and yeah, the much deeper aspects to what it means to, to forage our own medicine and to, um, yeah, to be in more connection with the land. So I'm just going to read a, a short piece from the book to give you a, a taste and you'll be able to find out more about it and, and purchase the book in the link below. So this is from the first chapter. Answering the call. The air becomes wetter and the breeze crisper. The first signs of the shift from summer to autumn become apparent. There is a felt sense of the oncoming change of ways. With this comes the call to retreat inwards. Deep within the soil, the mycelium networks begin to awaken. As the liberty caps start to peak, their little heads above ground, they process and break down the remnants of summer that lay in the soil and integrate them back into the earth from which they came. Their duty is to support nature's process of letting go into the death phase of the cycle of life. <clears throat> As humans, we can process in a similar way. We mark the autumnal equinox when the light of day equals the dark of night. And by doing so, we honour the year's growth, celebrate the harvest and welcome the onset of the dark days ahead. We are invited to do as nature does, slow down, integrate, regenerate. Once we answer the call to go inward and choose to work with the medicines of the land to assist us along the way, the journey begins. The next step is to explore intentions. At this point there may be a temptation to skip straight to the foraging section and bypass the intention setting completely, but with this book comes an invitation to take a step on the path which leads beyond the concept of simply foraging and using magic mushrooms as a, in a recreational way. What lies ahead is a journey of learning how to weave spiritual practice and reverence into the magic mushroom experience as a whole, from forage to ceremony, as a means of creating greater connection with ourselves, nature and with spirit.